In this video, we're gonna talk about Human Generator, which is a versatile tool to create human characters in Blender. And you can do this with a lot of control over the creation process from gender, ethnicity, footwear, and everything else in between. During the creation process, you can literally customize every single part of your character from eye color, height, body type, and so much more. You can fine tune your creation to your heart's content using the tools the Human Generator add-on offers. Human Generator version 3 was released a few days ago and it brought with it many remarkable improvements. For example, completely new and improved hair that looks more realistic and believable. There are now 30 hairstyle updates and additions in total between new and improved. There is also a new batch mode that allows you to work on multiple characters at the same time. This can be very handy if you are populating scenes indoors and especially outdoors where you need to create a lot of people. And the best part is, human generator performance has been improved to handle the sheer number of characters in the scene. If you are new to this add-on, let me help you understand a few things real quick. The human generator add-on helps you create fully modeled, textured, and also rigged realistic 3D characters in Blender with a couple of easy and simple steps. The whole process can be divided into two phases the creation phase and the finishing phase. And some of the major features include, of course, an easy character creation process, automatic rigging and facial animation, which is really needed, extremely detailed textures. Also, the human generator is compatible with our kit, and you can also create your own presets, custom outfits, shape keys, hairstyles, and start in human. In addition to that, you have the ability to bake textures easily and more. The first thing when you start working with this add-on is to choose your human gender. After that, you have 37 starting human presets between males and females, and you can choose from Black, Asian, Caucasian, and Hispanic. These are only a starting point, because you can customize your human as we go through the upcoming phases. The first phase is the creation phase. In this phase, you can choose your human body proportions, and you can either use a random function to randomize body proportion values, or use the muscular, overweight, and skinny preset sliders. In this phase also, you can control height, face deformation, skin material, eye settings, and hairstyles. In the second finishing phase, you can control a few things like clothing, position, and expressions. With clothing and footwear, you can pick your human's outfit and footwear. You have quite a collection to choose from though. The add-on comes with 16 clothing attire and 7 footwear item presets between casual, office, summer, and winter. You can also edit the clothes material and pattern by selecting the clothing item you want to edit. In this phase, you can also choose a pose for your character. With the 29 new poses of Human Generator version 3, there is now a total of 52 poses. You can also choose from 32 facial expression presets. All expressions are set up as shape keys so you can animate all of them. And finally, you can always revert back to the creation phase by clicking the revert to the creation phase button. And this will undo all the finishing phase changes. If you are interested in this add-on, you can find the necessary links in the description. I also wanted to remind you guys that the Blender market is having right now the biggest sale of the year. So if you have an add-on or a course you want to get, this is your chance to get it at a lower price. If you don't know where to start, I already have in the description of this video a list of the best-selling and the most powerful Blender add-ons ever created. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next one.